Hi everybody, uh, I thought I'd do something a little bit different today. We're going to look at some in-house volleyball practice, alright? Now, volleyball is three main shots really. One is called uh, the dig, okay, so it's in this position there. Okay, so your hands are like that. There is the set, where you use that to set somebody up normally, okay? And then there is the spike, which is a very attacking, attacking shot, again, over the net quite, quite fast and hard, alright? The bigger the ball you've got, probably the easier, because it has a bigger surface area, but if you want to challenge yourself a little bit like I am, use a small ball, that's absolutely fine as well. I'm doing it on my own against a wall, preferably when you do it in your house, you want to use uh, use somebody else to catch the ball, just so we don't smash anything in, in your house, okay? We don't have any upset grown-ups. Alright, so, the first activity we're going to do is, feet shoulder width apart, like this, I'm going to look at the dig, we're going to throw it up in the air, and when it comes about this height, I'm going to use the dig and hit the ball against the wall. My partner's going to film, film where the ball goes, all right, after I've hit it. Okay, so we're going to do five shots of each one. This is the dig. Just there. Okay. Try and make sure the ball it hits your wrist area just there, your forearm and wrist area just there. Okay. So you lock your hands in there. And again, keep your eye on the ball. That was better. Okay, straight back to that one. That was two. Three, it should come straight back to you. Four, Ooh, nearly. We'll do one more. Five, make sure you get some nice height when you throw it up, just to, just to really, get that, really get that fluency uh, and smooth movement with your arms. Okay, next one we're going to do is the set. All right, so the set, you're going to push it up this time, make sure you don't need any lights in your house. Okay, you can always use your garden as well. All right, so the set, knees apart again. Okay, on balls of my feet this time, I'm going to push it up like that. Okay, you watching? Like that. Normally you'd push it a little bit higher, but obviously you've got a ceiling in your house, so just be careful. Make sure the ball's really soft. All right, so we'll push it up again. You can do a little, little, little jump as well. If it's a ceiling, that's fine, because I've pushed it up. So I'm using there my fingers there, look, just about there. Okay, and again, pushing it up, really pushing it up. But again, that was a bit better at four. Look how I bend my knees. Five, I'll do one more. Okay, next one is the spike. Now that, 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 that set, I hit it up, the spike. I'm going to hit it down really hard. I'm going to get over the ball, the top of it, and hit it down as hard as I can. I'm going to throw it to myself. If you want your, someone in your house to throw the ball up to you, and then do it as a progression, that's even better. Or you can just throw it to yourself. So this is the spike, okay. Hitting it long and hard. You can always use one hand if you want to. Like that, that's two. Three. I'll do it again, two hands this time. That's four, two hands again. And we'll do one more. Two, what, what, two hands and one more with one hand. Yeah, and again. So if you notice on that last one, my body leaned forward into the shot and I got even more power, okay? Leaning forward gives me more power, okay? Um, so remember, big, knees bent, like that, okay? Every forearm set, pushing it up, okay? And the spike is really hard and low, uh, low down. For progression, you use a partner to throw you the ball. Uh, if you want more space, okay, or you've not got a soft ball, make sure you do it outside, just so you don't smash anything in your house. All right, uh, have fun, guys.